So this is just a short video to demonstrate some of the features. This model scope clock has the most features of any. And besides the embedded Wi-Fi on the microcontroller, which allows you to connect to your network to extract time and data automatically. It also has this GPS module plugged into this that will, with the mini antenna in the back. That'll allow you to extract the time and date from a satellite signal. And it also has this tall one standing up as a Bluetooth module. This will allow you to connect using an app on your phone, your iPhone called Light Blue, and has a little fist icon. So I'm gonna open that up and it should, uh, should pick up all the peripherals and this one is Hauchon. I name all the Bluetooth modules Hauchon and a number. This one's Hauchon 8. I'm going to connect to it. And then we're going to go to the, the, the screen. We're going to go to the last line on the next screen. We're going to change this from hex. Touch the hex. Change it to UTF-8 because that's the protocol we're going to use to communicate with it. And then write new value. Uh, Say I want to go to the menu, I'm going to use a capital M. All the commands are one capital letter. And send it that, and the menu will appear. Uh, each line you can select by typing a capital letter S, and that will select the next line. Now it's on the time zone. You can select the frequency, time zone, appropriate for your area. Uh, DST is daylight savings time. You can turn that on or off if necessary. It's, it's automatic, but if you need to adjust it, you can use that. Turn it. Wi-Fi on uh, means it's currently set up to extract time and date from our network. Um, say if I want to change that to the GPS module, I'll type a capital S until I select that line. And then I will use a capital C to change the option on that line, as it does on all lines. And, uh, okay, the, the options are Wi-Fi off, if for some insane reason you want to just set the time yourself, you can knock yourself out and do that. So I'm going to set it on Wi-Fi GPS, and then I'm going to select, um, the next line and then I'm going to exit the menu by um, typing a capital A and that should take it back to the run screen and now it should be extracting time from <clears throat> from the GPS module um, and by the way the GPS module will blink about one blink per second when it has a strong lock on a satellite so that's, that's about it, thanks.